afternoon, folks. Big Bo with RVs with Big Bo at Parkway RV Center. Getting kind of late in the day, but I wanted to do this travel trailer review. Don't get many of these in. These aren't mass produced like uh, like the Keystones and the and the Forest Rivers and Thors and stuff like that are. And uh, this is a grand design travel trailer, guys. You don't see many of these on the used market compared to many other brands. This is a 2019 grand design transcend and this is the model 28 mks a personal favorite of mine that is a rear kitchen and uh, overall length is 34 almost 35 feet long uh weighs 7400 pounds guys these are built by winnebago industries i mean these are not a cheap camper they weren't cheap when they were new they're not cheap used they're very well built very well insulated and probably one of the better built modern campers you can buy um, as far as overall build quality i mean these things are built to last double insulated roofs with up to r40 insulation heated enclosed underbelly i mean just super super nice got a slide out outside kitchen or outdoor kitchen and um, even though this looks like the the tin siding they use on a lot of them. This is actually fiberglass. You've got a large power awning, alloy wheels. I mean, just super build quality all the way around. Uh, six gallon DSI gas electric water heater. Got your outdoor kitchen with your cooktop. Doesn't look like it's been used. Everything folds up. You've got a 110 refrigerator that is cold it does work which we guarantee it to work anyway you do have magnetic catches so you don't have to worry about those plastic catches getting broken all the time i think that's a cool feature to have you've got a monster 35,000 btu furnace this is definitely a four seasons travel trailer has 50 amp electrical service it has two Roof airs, that's something you don't see in many campers as well. Stabilizer jacks. Man, it's a nice one, guys. For 22.9. Other ones are on RV Trader for up to $30,000. Other 2019 28 MKSs at other dealerships. We're not other dealerships, guys. We're Parkway RV Center. We got the best prices out there, period, bar none is set up for the fury and solar charger 10 amp it already got your hookups so if you want to buy the solar panels and all that it just plug plug and play man good looking camper guys really good looking and you know we have delivery service available two dollars a mile uh one way if you need it spare tire on the back That's some water dripping from the ACs. I actually got both of them running. I've got 50 amp service running right now. And uh, to be a 19, this thing's in really great condition. There's only one issue on the inside I'll show you that we're going to take care of. Um, but other than that, I mean, it's just super nice. Got the 82 inch interior ceiling height. Let's look inside this 28 MKS. Ooh, that air, that blast of cold air hit you. Because it is a little warm today, even when it's cloudy. I love the rear kitchen floor plan. To me, for a couple's model, this is the most popular floor plan you can have because it really gives you a lot of more space. It gives you a lot more food prep area and a ton more storage got a 15,000 btu ducted roof air you've got a table booth that's going to make a bed you do have a six cubic foot gas electric uh rv refrigerator for remember this is right before the pandemic when this was built so this is back when they actually still but still put the uh gas electric refrigerators in them so even if you don't have power, you can still have a cold refrigerator by running it off propane. Got the thermal foil um, countertops. Got the nice cabinets, microwave, stovetop, oven, big TV in it. 
the uh, theater seating right across from the television in great shape cushions here in great shape the only weird thing about it and you know I am going to well unless I'm gonna have we're gonna pull this somebody had duct taped this sofa which I can't imagine why the previous owners would have done that unless something's wrong with it so chances are we're going to replace this now if by some miracle of the good lord we pull that duct tape off and everything's brand new and everything's perfect then of course i'm not going to replace it i seriously doubt that's the case but if it is you know it's going to be the same sofa but if we pull that off and and you know whatever reason they've duct taped if it's torn or or whatever then we're going to replace this couch and we'll match the colors up the best we can so um Either way, you're going to have a good sofa in here, whether it's this one or the one we replace it with, that this one winds up being bad. And again, guys, I'm 99% sure it's probably bad. That's why they duct taped it. I love how people do everything they can short of fixing it the right way. I just, that kills me sometimes how people do that. Spend 40 grand on a camper and too cheap to fix the sofa the right way, to either get it reupholstered or replace it correctly. I, I just don't get people sometimes. Other than that, that's really the only downfall to this thing. 15,000 BTU ducted roof air. You've got a large bathroom right here with a sink, RV toilet, nice stand-up shower. Thanks to the extra tall roof, you don't need a skylight, so that's one less thing you got to worry about. A vent fan in here. You go to the front. It's really cold up here because... You've got a second 13,500 BTU kicker unit in here. Queen Island 60 by 80 bed. You do have some storage overhead. You do have solid sliding door for privacy. You do have large closet area right here. Pretty neat, guys. Really, really cool. And, um great deal on it too compared to what they're bringing online y'all y'all don't realize but you know everything built after 2020 you know everybody wants these you know there's more people that will buy this thing being a 19 than they would being a 2021 model or a 2022 model or even a later 2020 model because you know everybody knows the reputation of the pandemic built ones Believe me, uh, we get one in a late model used one that's 2020 and newer. We usually have to spend more money fixing stuff on it that were factory defects that I can't believe they let go like that. Um, and no RV's perfect. I mean, you know, any RV you buy, you're going to work on whether it's new or used or whatever. But they were better built before the pandemic. Um, back when, you know, they had experienced workers at the factories building these they had a steady supply stream back in the good old bc days before covid so you know these these ones like this that were built a year or two before covid are for for smart shoppers and experienced shoppers are in more demand and actually more desirable than a brand new 2023 model and a whole lot cheaper i mean i was saw these things brand new online for in the 40s 44 or 45 and guys you don't walk in in a new dealership and let's just say this thing was advertised for 44 or 5 brand new you don't walk in there and be able to take one home for 44 or 5 that 44 or 5 is going to turn into sixty thousand dollars plus by the time they add all the fees the upsells like the extended warranty the gap insurance and all that stuff they're not going to let you just buy it for the advertised price no guys here it's different here it's 22 nine plus applicable sales tax that's it take it to the bank easy simple and done there's no surprises no upsells the only other fee there is is if you want to deliver it as two dollars a mile one way or a dollar a mile round trip whichever one's easier for you to figure up that's it you go to these other dealerships they're going to try to sell you everything in the sun on top of it and a lot of times they force you to buy that stuff and you might as well go ahead even before you add your sales tax go ahead and add eight ten twelve even up to fifteen thousand dollars in dock fees prep fees upsells like extended warranty gap insurance and all that stuff on top of that and uh, that's how they make their money guys you never walk in there 
uh, for that price. And um, guys, that's what we run into. That's how people get buried. They get upside down. It's like, uh, it'd be like if I sold you this thing for, uh, um, it's like if I sold you this thing for twenty two nine, but told you, hey, the only way I'm gonna sell it to you for twenty two nine is if you go through one of my lenders where I can make money on the financing, and um, if I uh, added uh, all these extra services, you had to buy a five year extended warranty, you had to buy this, 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 and this, and before you know it, that twenty two nine price turned into uh, thirty five to forty grand just to be able to buy it for twenty two nine, but. It sounds ridiculous, but that's what these other dealers do, guys. So anytime you buy from another dealership, just buy the camper. If they won't let you just buy the camper for the advertised price, get up and walk out. There's other RVs and other RV dealerships out there. You know, try to buy from independent dealers like us when you can. You'll be glad you did. Um, anyway, guys, this unit is 22.9. Haggle free firm. It includes our major systems inspection. We'll make sure that both ACs get to operating temperature. We'll make sure the refrigerator and freezer, both of them, get to operating temperature. We'll make sure your slide works. We check all your plumbing. Make sure your uh, your steps work and your power tongue jack works. And uh, we'll check your water heater, faucet, spigots, water pump, all that good stuff. And all that's included for the 229 plus applicable sales tax price. You know, any Mickey Mouse stub now we are, you know, we will replace that couch if it winds up being bad, which it probably will be. Uh, so you're going to get a good couch out of it either way you go. <laughs> so don't worry about that. And, um, and of course, guys, anything else, like I always say, we handle the big stuff, the stuff that can ruin your trip. Uh, everything else we leave to you. Like if you have a light bulb that's not working, um, that's up to you to fix it or not fix it. Or if you've got a drawer that's off track, that's up to you to fix it or not fix it. That's, neither one of those is gonna ruin your trip. A refrigerator not working can ruin your trip. A slide out not working can ruin your trip. That's why we check all that stuff, make sure it works at time of sale and guarantee it to work at time of sale. And we're not gonna sell you any of these up sales, guys, like these extended warranties, none of that junk. Because simply because it's not worth the paper it's written on. The reason these other dealers push all this stuff so hard and has got the general public brainwashed into thinking they have to buy this stuff is because they're taking a $800 warranty they pay $800 for and selling it to you for three dollars to $4,000 and, and pocketing the profit. And then adding it to a loan that they've got the interest rate marked up one or 2%, overcharging you by financing by hundreds, sometimes thousands of dollars over the life of an RV loan and they're getting you coming and going, guys. I mean, you're just you're you're just losing money hand over fist. And the time you pay it back, you may even if you bought a used one like this at one of those big corporate dealerships, you might as well just bought a brand new one for the amount of money you're going to pay back by the time it's all said and done. Because that's how bad you're getting ripped off. And and guys, we've been in business since 1968. We want you to come back to us. We want you to send your friends and family to us. And these other guys, they don't care. They're so big, they, they, they can sell enough RVs. They don't care. All they care about is how, if they sell you one time and maximizing profit. That one time they sell you, they don't care if you ever come back. They, they got so many uh, people that fall under the false impression because they're the biggest dealer in the world that they got the best prices in the world. It's actually the opposite. The bigger the dealer, the more the overhead, the, more, the, more, uh, the bigger the price. Like my grandpa used to say, who started this place in 1968, big dealers don't get to become big dealers by giving fair deals. You know, we've been here for over half a century in the same location. We didn't franchise, we didn't branch out. We've grown over the years, but just right here in the same location. You know, we pay cash for everything. We keep our overhead down. We don't spend millions of dollars a year in advertising because the more dealer spends, the more cost they pass down to the people that buy campers and RVs from them in the form of higher prices. I mean, it's simple economics. The more dealers spend, the more they have to make to break even. And how do the dealers make money? By making more profit. That means the more the people that buy RVs from them have to spend. So guys, that's how we do it. Anyway, come check out this Transcend. Go to my website, parkwayrvcenter.com. You can see pictures of it, factory brochure, 
Um, you can apply for financing there. We do have financing with approved credit down payment. Uh, with no dealer interest rate markup, we save you a ton of money and um, can really help you out, guys. And we take trade-ins and uh, we do have financing and we do offer nationwide delivery. Again, $2 a mile one way, a dollar a mile round trip, however you want to figure it. Thank you all for watching. Just wanted to do a quick video. So stay tuned for some more videos tomorrow. Smash me a thumbs up. Feel free to comment, share on social media. And um, stay tuned for some more videos and look forward to seeing you in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia. Also, don't forget to comment below. Let me know what you think about this transcend. Thanks again.